upcoming year. Um, resolutions challenge us to step on out of our comfort zones, um, leading to increased self awareness and improved well-being. Achieving these goals brings a sense of accomplishment, both boosting self-esteem. They act uh, as a source of inspiration, encouraging positive change in various aspects of life. In a sense, New Year resolutions contribute to a proposal and fulfilling journey, uh, guiding individuals towards becoming their best selves. Brilliant. Thank you. Thank you. Be, be more prepared next time with your presentation, okay? Okay, fantastic. Okay. Uh, um, I see Efetikin raising his hand. Have you solved your problem? Okay, I solved the problem. Well, yes, I'm sharing my screen. Here, can you see my screen? I think it's coming. Yeah, we can see the complete screen. You can open the okay. PowerPoint. I want one second, please. Yes. My topic is, why is it important to have a new resolution? Uh, and new resolutions can be an opportunity <clears throat> for you to fix your life. For example, if your, life's, if your life is going to be that they make your life better than and we use these re resolutions achieve most of goals and mm -hmm. finally we feel good uh, then we reach our goals by following these resolutions that's all of you thanks for listening me okay brilliant thank you is is your name um Efe or is it um it's Efe, right? Your name? Yes, Efe, right. Efe Tekin. Okay, thank you. Um Eslam Dora. You can quit sharing. Uh sorry. Yeah. Is a problem. Okay. I did okay, it. now I did it's it. all right. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. I can open Islam my presentation Dora. without my computer has a problem. Sorry for that, but I can talk. Uh, I want to answer the uh, sixth question. If you could rename 2024, what will you call it and why? If I could change the name of 2024, I would call it Take Action. Uh, because to me, high school has always felt like the beginning of something. Uh, like I should do something or at least try. I'm sure that 2024 will guide me in this regard because I'm not afraid to, to uh, afraid to do something anymore. I want to take a step. That's all. Thanks for listening. Brilliant. Thank you. We wish you greater and better actions for this year. Yamur Yaila. Okay. Um... Wait a second. Uh, where do we share our screens? Wait a second. So at the bottom, there's something called um, a button uh, with share screen. I think it has an arrow. It. Yeah, it has an arrow to the top. So you just click on it and choose the screen you want to share which is your powerpoint presentation and then okay. click on share and we can see it i'm sorry wait a second can i okay. do later uh, i can can you tell us what you have okay what you prepared uh, mm -hmm. uh, I was so your I'm... friends can hear you mm -hmm. Okay, uh, I'm going to talk about why is so why is it important to have a new year resolution. Um, uh, first, it helps you know your goals, and to be to become successful, you need to know what what you exactly want. And writing down your new year resolution helps uh, you become aware of what you want. Uh, it brings you a sense of responsibility because you know what are you going to do, and you 
and start to finally take actions. It improves self-discipline, as I said. Uh, once you start taking actions, you become more uh, confident with your. Um, you become more confident, and um, you you become more a dis disciplined person. And it helps you figure figure out your problems and find solutions. And your uh, because you can look back uh, at twenty twenty three and find. Like the last, you can look back at the last year and think, um, what did I do wrong, or and what did I do right, and you can point them out and find solutions for them. And your in your subconscious will focus on the goal by writing it down, and you will, um, even if you don't realize it, you will be working for your, um, a. a for the things that you aimed and that's all thank you for listening to me thank you so much and i'm glad that you mentioned the subconscious mind because it's also part of the process of achieving your goals in life brilliant um next one uh, mehmet selim Öztürk. i can't see the name here uh then we can pass uh, Ellis Oster. So I don't have a presentation, but I'm just going to talk about it. Okay. Um, my question was, what would I name 2024? I would name it my year because I want to do a lot of impressions on myself and I want to change the way I look at life and all that. That's it, I guess. That's it, very short. Okay, come with your presentation next time. It would be really great. So we have, as you can see, students from um, Kazakhstan, from India, from Mexico. They would love really to hear from you, your ideas and thoughts, especially if you put presentations and you know images. Um, others can be really, really inspired. Uh, again, thank you. Um, and the last one, Abdul Hamid Turkler. Turklo is sharing. Okay. Yeah. Can you show us your video? Can you open your video? Is it possible? Actually, I opened it. It opens. Okay. Now we can see you. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hello, everyone. Today, I'm going to explain to you to what's the new year explanation. Let's start. A new year explanation. A new year resolution is what we want to do in the new year. It must be good for us. Like, uh, wait a second, just uh, like having a new goal or uh, and uh, quitting some bad habits and uh, getting better at something. And here are a couple of examples like help others, get fit, enjoying life, lose weight, join gym, take a trip, and etc. Actually, that's all. Thank you all for listening to me. Thank you. And what would you like to share with your international friends about your new re new year resolution? Do you have anything specific? Actually, I just want to maybe get better at my exams at study and my English, uh, of course. Okay, brilliant. Thank you so much, Abdul, Abdul Hamid, right? Abdul Hamid Turkla. Yes. Thank you. Um, anyone else from um, Bursa? Shasha, Shukrish Shankaya, Anatolian High School. All right. So as you can see, we have uh, new friends here Thank from Bursa. Me too. Yeah. Yes. What's your name? From Bursa. Zainab. Yes. Zainab. Oh, yes. Yes. I can see that. All right. Go ahead. Zainab. Zainab Shiran, okay. right? Okay. One minute. Uh, I'm going to share my screen. Okay, uh, one minute, slide. 
today I'm gonna presentation about my new year resolution. Uh, first, I want to say uh, what is new year resolution, and I uh, use Cambridge Dictionary. Cambridge Dictionary says that new year resolution is a promise that you make to yourself to start doing something good or start doing something better on the first day of the year. However, as for me, new year resolution is a way to motivate, refresh, and restart yourself for the upcoming 365 days. Uh, and I want to talk about my new year resolutions. Uh, first, I want to lose weight uh, and to be cheerful. Also, I want to save my money because all things all the things uh, what I want are so expensive and I need money. Um, then I want to uh, speak English more fluently because uh, English is important language about all world. Um, then to learn new, learn new foreign language, I have a little bit uh, Korean too. Um, and lastly, I want to participate an Erasmus project in my school, and my school is so active at Erasmus projects, and I want to join them. Um, then, what makes a new year resolution easy or difficult to achieve? Determination and patience make it to easy achieve. If you are determined and patient enough, you can achieve anything as you wish, and on the other hand, have Having lack of confidence and belief make a New Year resolution difficult to achieve. When you don't believe strongly, you can't find enough motivation to take action. And uh, in 2024, I would love to do many things, but unfortunately, I can't describe any of them as crazy. I only want to have fun or enjoy what I do in love because all people need love. Finally, thank you for listening to me. Max, and we um, we love the cat smiling. Is that your cat or is it just a meme cat? You found no, uh, I found it on Google. Okay, it was fun. And also, thank you for your presentation about the resolution of the new year. Uh, do we have anyone else remained uh, from uh, Bursa, Turkey? Okay. Um, so we have, as uh, I'm telling uh, all of you, we have uh, new friends from uh, Turkey Bursa, Shukri Shankaya. It's an Anatolian, an Anatolian high school uh, project school with Ontario. And uh, they are here. So please say hello. Welcome them, please. <laughs> say welcome, India. Say welcome, Indonesia, if you are here. Today we are very quiet, I guess. All right, brilliant. Um, okay. Don't be shy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly. It, um, I think we have, um, I think we have one more, Eflin, is that okay, Emerald? Yes, 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 one more please, because we'll have a Eflin. lot of time. Okay, Eflin, go ahead. Um, uh, firstly, I want to share my screen. Okay. Deepika, Deepika is welcoming everybody from India. Talk about my new year resolutions. Uh, for me, it's important to motivate ourselves in whole year. Um, here, it's my... Uh, New Year resolution from 2024. Um, I have six uh, things to do. Uh, firstly, get good marks because uh, for me, school is really important. Um, second, uh, improve my English uh, because um, English is really important all around the world. And uh, I think it's a big opportunity to improve that. Uh, three, spend more time with my friends and my family. Um, I think it's because for 
a more sociable person, become more sociable, um, and spend great time I spend more enjoying. Uh, I think it's uh, important to uh, become a healthy person. Uh, five, earn gold medals in archery competitions. Uh, I do sports, so uh, I want to be successful in my uh, sports. Uh, so this is my other thing. Uh, sixth one is travel more. I love traveling. I I love uh seeing new places and um meet people evet. in there. Uh, so, thank you. Thanks for your attention. Yeah. Thank you so much. Um, can you also uh mute yourselves while listening to the presentation? Um. Um. Uh, Eflin, uh, you have a, a great notebook. I like that. You put your goals there. Also, uh, uh, are you good in archery? Mm -hmm. Yes, I think I am. Okay, that's great. We have a famous uh, Turkish champion in archery. What was his name? Uh, his name is Metagazos. Yes, exactly. Uh, thanks a lot, uh, Eflin. And do we have anyone um, from Bursa? Okay, uh, for students uh, from Bursa, um, um, so Mexico will take over now. And uh, here's how it's going to go. You're going to use your digital hand, raise your hands, and students will be asking each other. Um, then, um, We'll choose questions. We shared with you the questions. And you will choose a question. Uh, the moderator, Emerald, Emerald will uh, ask. Yeah, exactly. And you will be choosing someone uh, to answer. OK? So Emerald, the floor is yours. Thank you. Thank you so much. You did a very good job, teacher, for Henry and the students. Wow, 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 wow. Thank you so much for giving us your your, your I know your resolutions, okay, your presentations, okay, but I don't have more time, so I'm going to give uh, the time for uh, students from India and from Mexico and and also uh, some students from Turkey, okay. So please, please forgive me for my voice. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Get well soon. Get well soon. <laughs> thank you, thank you so much. Okay, so I'm going to ask the first question, okay. So we're going to be talking about a very good topic, as you know, as you could could hear the Turkish students. So we were talking about the New Year resolution. Okay, so the first question is, what is a New Year resolution? Babika, are you ready? Oh, yes. Go ahead, please, with the first answer. Uh, according to me, my New Year resolution are goals or intention that people set for themselves at the beginning of the year. They can be things like exercising more, learning new skills, or being kinder to others. It is a way to make positive changes in our life. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Mustafa, go ahead, please. In my opinion, um, the New Year resolutions are of mine is, well, um, I have two. One is to like I don't know, um how how can I say as um do many readings as I could do in highlights and um yes that's my new year resolution. <laughs> good 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 thank you, Angelo. Is when you set goals and resolutions for the year ahead, and set the goal of achievement them. Okay, thank you. Shravani. Yes, a uh, new year resolution is a tradition where a person makes a promise to change an undesired, undesired habit, improve their behavior, or achieve a person's goal at the start of a new year. Thank you. Okay, good. Thank you. Durja. Uh, 
I can hear you, Durja. You are muted, Durja. Yes, yes. Hello? Can you hear yes, me? Yes, yes, yes. Your microphone. That was great. Yeah. Okay. So, sorry, ma'am. So, new, new year resolutions means uh, people who resolves to be continue or uh, to be uh, good and uh, change their bad habits and uh, to improve their behavior at the starting and the beginning of the calendar. Yes. Wow, good. Thank you, Dorja. Um, please. Yes, um, my new year revolution that changing my behavior, uh, improve my English because English is very important all over the world. And I achieve the goals that I can't achieve at last year, 23. But I achieved that goals in 24. Wow, good. Good answer. Thank you so much. Okay, I'm going to ask you the second question. Okay, what is your new resolution? Um, year, well, what is your new year resolution and why? Okay, Babika. Uh, yes. Um, so basically, I don't have a new year resolution because my goals is to uh, my goals is to be be, uh, be the best virtual friend. Thank you. Thank you and, so much. And happy new year, everyone. Okay, perfect, perfect. Thank you, Mustafa. Thank you, Babika. Thank you. Um, are we on second question? The second. What is your new year resolution and why? Um, my new year resolution is to enjoy life. Ah, good. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. And why? Um, because um, I would like to enjoy life. Yes. Yes, of course. Thank you so much. My, pleasure. Uh, my new year resolution is try to read more and improve my attitude and help my mother with the home's work because because I I want to encourage my reading and make a difference by helping my mom. Wow. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Excellent boy. <laughs> oh, Brilliant. Thanks. Yes, uh, my new year resolution that uh, I I want to improve that things that I don't improve in last year because the uh, every person the improvement is needed. Okay, okay, good. Thank you, Dorja. Uh, okay, so my new year resolution is I want to. Uh, hello. So my new year resolution is to get uh, go, uh first place in the dance competition uh, in school because I love dance and I wanted to improve my dance skills and I wanted to get a step uh, up in the dance. Wow, to dance. Wow. I, I have a question. I have a question for Durja. What kind of dance? Like a traditional dance uh, in Marathi. Traditional Indian Marash dance. Uh, yes, mm -hmm. uh, which is called Launi. 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 Yes. Wow, we can make we can make, we can do a presentation of that <laughs> of music, okay, uh, dance. Yes, yes, that's good. That's good. Okay, the third. Well, I'm going to go. Well, no, no, Deepika, go ahead. We have a, a time. Okay, Deepika. Yes, ma'am. Uh, my New Year resolutions are: uh, I want to become uh, respectful and uh, helpful because. Uh, there are a lot of hell, uh, uh, re, uh, poor people in in over the world, uh, and I I do focus. I want to do focus on my goals, and I want to enjoy my next three sixty six days, and improve improve my English. Ooh, good. Improve your English. Thank you. Okay, Selan Kaplan, please. Uh, my new year resolution is a uh, good friendship. Uh, we start high school and uh, there is a new place uh, and I'm so much care about friendship. So my new resolution is good friendship. Thanks. Wow, good friendship. Thank you. Shravani. Yes, ma'am. Uh, my new year resolution is I want to become more successful in my life. And one more, I want to travel more and I want to explore new places. Thank you. You better travel to Mexico and Turkey. 
teacher Henry. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> okay, thank you, Shravani. Thank you. Okay, so I'm going to ask you, well, Jack Moore, go ahead. The second. <laughs> My new year resolution is to take violin courses because I've been watching this since uh, fifth grade and uh, um, and travel to other countries if that's possible for now. Um, yes. Good. One, one quick question. Um, so have you been playing the violin since uh, you said uh, fifth grade or age five? Can you repeat that? Like, uh, I said fifth grade, but I didn't fifth play grade. the violin. Yes, I I didn't play the violin. I just want it. Ah, you you've been wanting. Okay, all right. Thank you. You're going to, you're going to do it. <laughs> thank <laughs> you, thank you. Okay, the third question. Okay, why is important to have a new year resolution, Mustafa? Um, in my opinion, it is important to have new. New Year resolutions because well so that we could be more organized and to the new year of 2024 to be more organized good thank you thank you my pleasure yeah Babika uh, which question ma'am uh, number three uh, yeah okay uh, according to me New Year resolution can be both challenging and achievable, depending on our dedication and approach. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Angelo? Um, because that's how you set a goal to achieve, and if you set your mind to it with attitude and perseverance, it can be achieving. Achieve it. Achieve it. Thank you. Thank you. Um. Okay, uh, having new year resolution is a good thing because it can uh, every every year we can learn our mistakes and clear our mistake and uh, learn new things from our mistakes. Therefore, we can have a new year resolutions. Okay, thank you. That's a good one. Thank yeah. You. Yes. Thank you, Deepika. Uh, I think that new year, uh, new year resolution is important because uh, we want to explore our skills uh, in next year, new year. Good. Thank you, Shravani. Yes, new year resolution gives you a sense of meaning and purpose in your life by helping you identify what matters to you and how you can contribute to others. Thank you. Thank you so much. Islam, Dora, please. I think if people have a purpose, they will have something to do and they will always remain active in life, uh, which is to their benefit. I mean, uh, to being aimless is not a good thing. We have to do something. That's all. Okay, you, that's good. Good job. Thank good you. answer. Yes, good answer. Thank you so much. Durja. Okay, so New Year resolution is uh, very important uh, and it is a good thing because uh, we got opportunity to get things right. Last year, we what we did mistakes, uh, we can correct uh, in this year and um, uh, we can and also be organized uh, for the whole year. If we organize ourselves uh, for the whole year, we can do things properly like... Um, focused on your goals uh, we can achieve it uh, we can achieve your our goals uh, when we be organized so okay. the new age resolution is important yes yes really important thank you so much thank you thank you thank you let's go to the fourth question okay what makes an new year resolution both difficult um and easy to achieve okay babik uh, yes, according to me, New Year resolution can be both difficult and easy to achieve depending on various factors. They can be difficult because they often require efforts, uh, commitments, and, and sometimes stepping out of our comfort zones. It's all about finding the right balance and staying determined. Thank you. Thank you so much, Mustafa. Yes, sir. Um, are we in podcast? For me? Uh, are we in fourth question? Yes, uh, fourth question. 
Yes, for okay. a question. Um, I think that um, for uh, both of art, uh, yes, I think it's is um, the thing that makes um, a new year revolution. Um, in my opinion, is well, um, you need to be more hardworking on that to do, and to be more professional on that. Yes, to be more. And also, um, like. Yeah to manage time better. Okay, good, good, good answer. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you, Mustafa. Okay, Angelo. Mm, it, is easy, it is easy because we have a good year to achieve it and difficult because it can uh, be tedious to start working on it and with the possibility of getting desperate and abandoning our goals. Yes, good. Thank you. Um. Yes, the New Year resolutions can be hard or can be easy. It is our uh, it is our resolution about uh, if if it on our on ourselves. If we take hard, it will be going hard. If we take easy, it will be go easily and we can achieve that that's okay. a philosophical very <laughs> philosophical answer thank you all. thank you thank you thank you thank you. Thank, you. thank you okay deepika please yes uh, my new year resolution is get easy to achieve when i saw my mom dad and it get difficult to achieve because uh, uh, sorry when we have a lot of stress of that in our mind Okay, good. Thank you. Shravani. Yes. Uh, if I decide in my mind that it is easy to do, uh, th then I can do, I can achieve my New Year's resolution. But if I decide in mind that I can't do it, this is very hard, then it will be difficult for me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Durja. That's your turn. <laughs> Uh, okay, ma'am. So, new year resolution can be both difficult or easy. Uh, the difficult is when we take all the things at once to do, like four or five things uh, at once we goes to do. Uh, so, it will be very difficult to do. But uh, focusing on... Uh, Focusing on one specific goal, it makes uh, keeping resolution much more uh, achievable. So we should do uh, one by one things to uh, uh, achieve it. Thank you. Yes, of course. I think in like you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. Thank okay, you very much. Okay. Eslem Dora, please. I think what makes this difficult is people's concerns about themselves. Uh, because if you are confident yourself, you will not have difficulty making new decisions. And I think what makes this easier is people's happiness when they reach their goal. I mean, it is the happiness that comes after achieving your goals. Okay, good. Uh, Thank you. Good, 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 good. Also, also being aware that... Um, we've achieved it and being thankful, right? Sometimes we achieve things in life or some of us and then we forget about it and we get busy with life. So we, we become not thankful. So being thankful is really also important. Thanks, Eslem. Yes, yes, it's really important. Thank you so much. So let's go to with the, with the question number five, okay? What adjective do you want to become this year, Mustafa? <laughs> um i think i would like to be great in this new year and also um achieving because i like to achieve my goals for this year you are gonna do it don't forget about that <laughs> okay thank you angela Respon responsible only that because I want to improve in everything and for that I have to be responsible. Responsible, good. Responsible. Thank you. Yes. Um. 
okay uh, i want to i i am not good in my uh, in sports uh, therefore i want to improve in my uh, in the sports and make me perfect at at playing cricket cricket okay thank you thank you deepika yes uh, i think the uh, i think that the adjective i want to become in this year is hard working because in this time we uh, we do some hard work then it it makes easy to enjoy our next life good perfect perfect shravani yes ma'am i would like to become successful shravani this year Wow, good, <laughs> perfect. Thank you, Durja. Uh, okay, ma'am. So the adjective I want to become this year, which is creative, uh, uh, and active and focused, focused on my goals and uh, what I what I wanted to achieve, like uh, uh, first place in dance competition. Uh, that's my goal, and uh, active and active. Uh, when I will be creative and active, I can achieve the my goals easily. Wow, you can achieve it easily. Good, thank you. Okay, let's go to the next question. Okay, the question number six. So, if you could rename twenty twenty four, what would you call it, and why, Mustafa? I would like to call it uh, as a year. Where um, how can I say resolutions are gonna be done? For, for <laughs> good, 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 good answer. Thank you, Angela. Uh huh, Angela. Uh, if I call rename the year, I will call it a uh, year of responsibility, uh, responsibility, and growth. Responsibility and growth. Good. Thank you so much, Deepika. Uh, yes, uh, if I could rename two hundred and twenty-four, uh, I call it uh, amazing because there are uh, there are a lot of technology are 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 in work uh, in in these years. That's why I call it amazing. Okay, good. Thank you so much, Shravani. Yes, uh, if I had to rename 2024 something else, so it will be year of technology because as we are moving forward, our technology is also moving forward, advancing. Thank you. Okay, thanks. Thank, thank you so much. Let's go to the next question, the last one. Okay, so what is, what's the posi positively crazes Thing you would love to do this year and why? Okay, Mustafa. Trust me, teacher, I have a lot of things to do crazy. Um, yeah. and <laughs> I would like to tell most of those, drive a car and drive it to a tree. Wow. <laughs> At this point in a game. Okay. <laughs> And not I'm not talking about like the game, the whole website, for example, Steam or the or maybe like Steam uh, exploiting it. <laughs> yes, but in a good way. Like how can I say troll, admin troll. Okay, admin like, troll, okay. Games and like if if it's a multiplayer and then admin troll. Okay. Mm -hmm. good. And yes, that's okay. the two that I would like to say which I try it crazy on this. <laughs> Okay. That is good. Thank you. And to experiments on the multiplayer players. Okay. Yes, good. such as how can I say? Um when I was like watching on YouTube, I saw some videos such as like some people will buy um admin and then like troll people. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Interesting. Thank you. And hello. Um, travel to Cancun signs. It will the be the be the first time you travel be plain and you can experience a new emotion. A new emotion. A new emotion. Good, Deepika. Thank you, Angelo. 
yes uh, if uh, sorry i want to do lot of crazy thing but i think that i would love to do uh, uh, i will to, i will to, i would love to do creative creative things in in this year uh, because there are uh, a lot of uh, technology are uh, uh, going forward and the uh, and uh, and the tradition uh, tradition of the nations are uh, uh, remains back that's good thank you shravani uh, yes ma'am seven no yes the last one please uh, one crazy thing i would like to do this year is i want to uh, learn how to cook cooking thank you thank you thank you wow all of you have given us a lot of very good answers thank you so much for giving us that those okay but if you could see today we started with a different way with a different activity okay so please please if you would if you love to give us presentation or if you love to give us answers tell tell everything to your teacher so I'm going to be talking to the teachers. So, okay, as you know, you are here, you're going, well, you're practicing your English. If you would like to be giving us presentation, that will be very good because you are here to give us the best way of view. If you would like to give us presentation or if you would like to give us, I don't know, some answers or you can give us both, okay? So I'm going to give, I'm going to be talking to the teachers to just, to see the time sweet, to see sweet, so, a little bit. yes yes we're going mm -hmm. to be talking about that because in my case i, I have a many many students from mexico so that some of them is quite difficult quite difficult to give us some presentation presentation because most of them they couldn't speak very good english and most of them they they don't have time and a lot of kind of things okay but in my case it's very good to give us uh, to giving you so the answers, okay? But if the teacher, Henry, he, he, I don't know if, if the teacher says that it's really good to be motivating you with presentations, that will be awesome, okay? So you are going to have a time for that. And I'm going to see the time because I, I like to give you like uh, some games like Kahoot, you know? We so, have a Kahoot waiting. I don't know. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, so okay. I have a Kahoot game. So if you want... Can I add something? Can yes. I add something? Yes. Um, so sure. for presentations as well, as, as you know, we've been experiencing since last year, um, technical problems. Uh, so two things I would really recommend students. First thing, please do your rehearsal before you join. Make, you know, double check uh, how you can use Zoom or sharing. And mm -hmm. secondly, it would be great if you uh, speak, you know, make it, make it your own. Uh, speech. Of course, you have every text and everything, but we want you to really summarize, and that's what we call critical thinking. Summarize what you are reading and what you want to tell us, and uh, just uh, flow. And uh, no one is perfect. We don't want it to be perfect. We want you to make mistakes. We, no one is stopping you. No one is correcting you. We do it on purpose like this. We don't want to correct. We want you just to speak. Okay. So feel comfortable. It's a cozy, comfortable. A place to be okay very comfortable because this is your house <laughs> yes exactly we're here, yes we're here to practice your english and i know that all of you you you're you, this is not your native language you know so we are making a very good effort to be talking and to be communicating the different topics okay so that's good so well i have six minutes so if you want we can play Okay, and and then you can be talking to your teacher, and the teacher they are going to be telling me about presentations and sorts of both. Okay, so the next activity next Saturday we can we can we can be doing something really really interesting. Okay, as the as we can as we have done today. Okay, so let's play, let's play, let let's, me give let's you. Let's go. Yeah.
Okay, I'm going to give you the numbers. Okay. Let me see, let me see. Can you see it? Yes, you can also use the QR code. Yes. 